What up, YouTube family? We're about to go ahead and react to some random TikToks. And by the way, my girlfriend, she got me some Christmas items. We're going to go and review all those in a little bit. But yeah, I love these items too. I'm actually using one of them right now. That's why I look so much better in the lighting. So let's go ahead and get started on uh, reacting to these videos. Right now, we're about to see the coolest dad on earth. This, this is the coolest dad on earth. There That's not funny. I don't, it's not that funny. I You've been know. playing League of Legends every night and you're still only silver? Yeah, okay, listen. You don't understand how the game you works. You fucking suck. Right. <laughs> That's the greatest dad on earth. Hey. That's the greatest dad. On, no, you can laugh. I was just saying. That's the greatest dad on earth. Oh, snap. She's with me. She's just off camera right now because she got warrants. So. Shut up. Not that. <laughs> So let's go ahead and react to the next video. Let's see. Here. I can't hear you. He ain't saying anything. Okay, next video. Yo, you want to see something cool? No. Well, I'm going to do it anyway. Ooh! 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 Wait, I, I, no, no, no. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm going to tell you right now what I want. Gotta get the katana, okay? I think that's the katana. Then you got a spear, bro. bro. Oh my gosh! I want it all. Okay, what what type? You want it all? Mm -hmm. Hold up, hold up. Okay, okay. See, let me let me let me let me just zoom forward. This is doing too much. <laughs> this weapon right here is doing too much. This knife right here, that's kind of you know. I've seen somebody make that knife online. Uh, this right here is doing too much. What are we doing with that? We're sticking that in somebody's skull and, and spinning it? Like, we're, All three of them are the way they spin it. We're, we're doing too much. Oh, wait. That ain't a katana. That is a... Oh, my God. That's another spear. What, oh. That's so they really trying... Man, we out here trying to destroy people's lives and stuff. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> trying to destroy people. That first week shit is a sham, boy. Cause it kind of doesn't mean anything anymore, and you can—it's really easy to manipulate them. You can buy YouTube so ads. You know the things—the things on YouTube when you when you can things on YouTube when you when you can uh, skip them after five seconds. You can buy those, and anytime one of those like it, it, it can advertise your album, but anytime one of those reaches five seconds, it counts as a stream. So if I wanted to promote my album on YouTube and it turns out to be one of them ads that you can, you can watch it for five seconds and then you can skip it if you want to or you can watch the whole thing. But if you skip it, I still got my five seconds and that counts as a stream. It's a bitch. <laughs> it's, it's, not, it's not fun trying to keep up with the shit and it's not fun being a part of it either. Obviously, why would you not be a part of it? You I know guess what, what he's like, saying wanna, is like... You want to have good numbers. You want to feel good. But... That shit only feels good to the people that don't know what they had to do to get those. Numbers. Count it like your Twitch, your your Twitch. I, I think he's you, talking about the, the ads are upset at the way this couple reacted to finding out that they were having a girl instead of a boy. <laughs> As you can see from, so, well, I'm I'm gonna let him. I would let him go ahead and finish commentating. Uh, if you can, I'm, I'm going to see it if I can have the video down so you can actually see the uh, TikTokers in their names. So you can actually go look at their videos. But if, if you want to hear his commentary, go ahead and check out his video. It's gonna, the names are going to be in this upper right corner. I hope you can see them. I might need to move this thing. Hold on, let me move it a little bit. J just so you can see the TikTokers name. I'm going to try to have my video down in the, in the small area. Of myself so you can see these tiktoker names because i'm not trying to take credit for their content i'm just simply reacting but here's my thing it's 100 his fault it's the man that determines the sex not the woman so if they if they want to be upset it, it looks like she was hoping for a boy but then he got the the pink shirt on maybe i don't know it's like you got a. It's like you disappointed in having a girl. Like, why is she disappointed in having a girl? Does she realize how difficult girls are to raise? I'm just saying. Maybe that's why she don't want no girl. 
he know he know it's gonna be difficult because you know you're gonna have boys after your daughter because then you think in your head oh, i know what boys are up to you just tell them on yourself stupid so the way you treated a woman remember if you have daughters it's gonna come back on them. yeah i i i, I, I don't care too. <laughs> that, that this album right here is it uh I can't pronounce her name. My head hurts What's way. It uh is it L Leahi Lee? I my head hurts too much right now. I've been having massive headaches. Uh but yeah, we you know, everybody be thinking their music is original and now don't even realize that the majority of people in the hip hop industry and rap industry sample older musical content. Like duh. You know how hard it is to keep coming up with original beats? Sometimes you gotta Sometimes people do it out of respect for the artist and at least give credit, but other people just be lazy and be like, hey, let me go ahead and just sample this. This nose is bigger than that, boy. Your dick small, cuz. I'm a child, nigga, a nose. <laughs> this nose is bigger than that. <laughs> what? What the? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm a child, I know. <laughs> he was serious, too. <laughs> wow, that's funny. That's crazy. That's crazy. Yeah, for kids to be talking like that. Next. What the heck? Wait, wait, what the? What? Oh, they destroy swarm that car. Look at that. It, it, it looks like a whole bunch of, I don't know what that is. It, is it? They're flying. I can't tell what they are. Cause, oh, roaches. Wait, wait, wait. No, it can't be roaches because some of them are flying. It's it's something. Some ro ro some ro Gnats, fly. roaches. Sometimes what? roaches do. Fly. It's bugs, okay? It's bugs. It's bugs. I'm gonna just say it's bugs. I'm not trying to classify the bug. I'm not trying to classify what the bug is. It's a bug. It's a bug. It's a bug. My brain can't process oh, certain things. This how you get slapped. Would have hit her in the face with a brick, y'all would have missed. That's that's how you end up. Hold up, hold up. Let me go back here. Hold on, me. Oh, uh, oh yeah. That, he's just showing that first part. That that's how you get slapped. That's how you get slapped when you up in somebody's face like that. That's how you get slapped. But if you notice, this guy is looking directly down at her butt. Let's let's be real. Look look where this guy's eye is. Look look where his eye is. Look look where his eye is focused. <laughs> He don't even care about the argument. Look, 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 let's start from the beginning. Look where he's looking at the whole time. Look where he's looking at the whole time. He don't care about the argument. <laughs> That's where he's looking at. Watch Cassidy getting up ahead of steam. Oh, no, he's got him up. Oh, no, 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 Is, it, no. is that Not this. Cassidy? Not anything but this. That's Morris Cassidy. Oh my goodness. That's Morris Cassidy. Oh my goodness, he's been doing this. It's so childish. He's been doing this. Morris Cassidy's one of my favorite wrestlers. He been doing this. Oh man, that's hilarious. Uh, that's right. Go ahead. That's got it. That's got it. <laughs> oh, Ooh, 
Somebody should go in there and stop them. <laughs> I was joking. I didn't know they was yet. I didn't know he made a video like that. Yeah, 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 yo, yo. I'm, I'm where his head is at. I'm where his head is at. Ain't no way y'all gonna let me go in there and stop some big, big ass gorillas. No, let them fight. I like say, let them solve their problems. They, they very good at doing that. <laughs> okay, we're gonna say, you broke up with your ex because he was broke and didn't have a job, but you are, but now you are cheating on your rich boyfriend with a broke guy because your rich boyfriend is always busy with work and does not spend enough time with you. <laughs> no, you're female. I want to hear your opinion on this. Look, nothing to say. Nothing to say. Because she also knows that that, that bull doesn't make any sense. Nothing to say. It doesn't make sense. No, it doesn't make sense. That junk is hilarious. You left the broke dude because he broke and got with the rich guy and then cheated on him with the broke dude because the rich guy don't spend time with you. Okay. So it, you can't have it both ways. Either you want somebody who's super rich, but they're going to be gone all the time making money, or you want to spend quality time with somebody, but they're not going to be working as much. There has to be a balance, Okay. Like, get somebody who's at least willing to work at least 30 hours, 35 hours a week. Then maybe you can balance that out. That's funny. Now we have more. Now notice how Oprah treats... Dude, nobody gives... Yo, before she even gets into the video, which I got to turn this volume down, by the way. Nobody cares about Oprah. Nobody cares about Oprah. If you see a video on TikTok the way she did Taraji P. Henson, after Taraji P. Henson admitted that uh, certain actresses don't get paid as much. You would think Oprah would back her up on that, right? No. Oprah just ignored her, and then she went and moved to the other side, so then it was Fantasia and Taraji P. Henson standing there, and Fantasia actually felt the energy was off and knew what was going on. Then Oprah gets towards the other end. She's all open and smiling. Everybody knows oh, Oprah crooked. Let me say this real quick before I let this continue to play. Y'all got to remember, Oprah didn't make billions of dollars from black people. She made that from white people. That's white people money. That's who she caters to. This is the same woman that when Hawaii was in trouble, you think she spent her billions of dollars, some of her billions of dollars up in Hawaii? No. From what I heard, she kept she had security personnel make sure nobody went on her property, you know, protect her property, you know, even though people were starving and homeless. And then her and the rock had audacity. Two people who are rich to ask poor people in a broken economy to send money to fix a place where they're already at and can fix themselves. Man, get get out of here. Oprah's a joke. Everybody joined this press conference. Taraji is first, right? Now look at her eyes. She looks down when she's talking about the movie. She wasn't excited about it. Now, you notice how Oprah is touching him, he's touching her back, he's excited, he loved the experience, he wants to do it again. Oh! Fantasia was surprised that Oprah touched her, to the point that Oprah removed her hand. Fantasia knows something. Danielle, she's- Remember, I just got through saying that, that there's a video of them five standing together and how Fantasia felt the energy was off. This shows you right here. She felt that energy was off. Into the game, she didn't know what's going on, but she's just excited to be there, and we're excited for her. Now, Taraji, notice, notice her voice. It's not feeling a con before her voice. Yeah. Look at that. She's just. But see, here's the thing, though. Monique told y'all this a long time ago. Nobody wanted to listen to her. They didn't care. Or y'all, oh, Monique's crazy. Just like Corey Feldman was telling you about the pedophiles in Hollywood. And uh, Randy Craig was telling you about the Star Whackers. Everybody told y'all all this. Everybody wanted to ignore it. Then all of a sudden, more people, oh, well, this is true. No, but when they spoke out about it, they was crazy. But then number two person speak out about it, all of a sudden, now it's, oh, it's got to be a pattern going on. No, it been there. There's been people talking about how Hollywood is. Y'all just wasn't listening. 
Nobody lies like a black person saying they're half Native American. And it's their grandma fault they're saying it too. Africans here in the U.S. are English-speaking Africans. Africans in Trinidad are English-speaking Africans. Africans in Jamaica are English-speaking Yo, Africans. Yo, can you grab that? Africans. Africans in Jamaica are English-speaking Africans. Just like Africans who live in Ghana, just like Africans who live in Kenya, mm -hmm. just like Africans who live in Zimbabwe. English-speaking Africans are still Africans, no doubt about it. Africans in Haiti are French-speaking Africans. Mm -hmm. Africans in Martinique are French-speaking Africans. Just like Africans who live in Guinea, just like Africans who live in Algeria, just like Africans who live in the Congo. French-speaking Africans are still Africans, no doubt about it. Africans in Cuba... Basically what he's saying is, no matter where you at, if your bloodline is descended directly from a tribe, no matter what language you speak, no matter where you're at, you're still African. Which, technically, when you think about it, if life started in Africa... now with a lawsuit many are talking about. A judge has ruled fast food giant Burger King what? must face a lawsuit claiming its it famous is. Whopper appears larger on menu boards than it actually is. Ariel Reshef is here with that story. Okay, of first morning, of all, y'all already know when people chew the food like this. Nobody chews like that. In real I've never seen a person take a bite into a burger and be like... Nobody chews like that. You're gonna chew... Sometimes you be smacking when you eat your food. Nobody eats food. Nobody does that. That, that junk looks stupid. I don't know why they put that in the commercial. Good morning to you, Robin. This lawsuit alleges Burger King ads in its restaurants told a Whopper about the Whopper and that the size of the burger was actually Stop. smaller than it appeared on the menu board. So leaving customers unsatisfied and, well, hangry. Yo, tell me why some of these Whoppers be about the size of the Whopper Jr. itself. And then a Whopper Jr. be about the size of a uh, cheeseburger. This morning, a major food Y'all know none of this is real, right? Burger oh, King's all that's, yeah. half that's plastic. Reportedly prioritize this. The upcoming MCU's X-Men reboot could reportedly prioritize female characters in leading roles. Oh, man. If this is true, there's going to be a good chunk of the fandom that is going to be pissed. Or... You can just have X-Men play out the way it is. You don't need to... Pro everybody know Rogue. Everybody know Jean Grey. Everybody know Mystique. Everybody know Psylocke. Everybody... Like, these female characters are already predominant. So why turn around and make it prioritize the female characters? What's... what's go Okay, what's really... Go it's like whoever put... In charge of Marvel Studios, just it's like their goal is just to destroy Marvel Studios with just wokeness. Like, why would you change a product that all X Men is literally a comic book series that is about discrimination? For you to turn around and discriminate against the comic that is about discrimination. That gotta be that new dumb. That's that's that new dumb. Appreciate it, bro. Damn, bitch, you ain't gonna say thank you? Where are you? Who are you talking to? To you? Nah, you talk, I think he's talking to you. You don't let him talk to me like that? What? Ah, jelly as shit. Young boy, where are you? Tell your bitch to say thank you. Damn, bitch, you can't say thank you? Oh, that's what I Who thought. Where, where, where where that? He done held the door before you. You a disrespectful ass bitch. Why the fuck you let. Hey, you ain't. Nah, <laughs> okay. Just... Okay, I know, I know this is, a, I know this is a role play TikTok. That joke is actually funny, but it, 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 if if your first move is to pull out a gun at every single incident, maybe you shouldn't own a gun. I'm, I'm just saying, it's implied. But this skit, I ain't gonna lie to you. This dude, he does funny skits like this, but there are people who literally do this in real life. When they confront it with some, first thing they do is I'm gonna pull out the burner. It's like. Yeah, okay, like as if everybody else don't have one. We got 63 million Americans who can carry, so it, it ain't going to work. But this kid is funny. Let's see the rest of it. Hey, thank you to the man. Damn. You can't be serious. I'm dead ass, man. Hey, bro, she just being a bitch today, bro. Go on here, bro. Go on here. All right. It's your bitch in line, bro. All right, bro, bro, bro. bro. My fault, guys. Next time, I'm like, jelly, you shit. Appreciate it, bro. 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 Appreciate it
appreciate it, bro. Damn, bitch, you ain't gonna say thank you? <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna say that. Go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. <laughs> that natural instinct when you want to say you too, that shit is hilarious. It's like, like you tell a waiter, hey, when a waiter be like, enjoy your food, you be like, you too. <laughs> Hey, I just slipped up and did that sometimes. I was like, damn. Like, enjoy enjoy your meal. You too. I was like, wait. <laughs> <laughs> I've done that sometimes. Snap. Wow. That, wow. That just. And you still miss. Look, he, he got to calculate the stupidity on that. <laughs> you go down here and you still miss. <laughs> if failure was a person. Oh, man. A YouTuber broke into the Bohemian Grove two weeks ago and captured everything in HD. This video is like the first of its kind I've ever seen. He got a ton of footage, but let me show you what he got of the owl. Mine. And that's the, uh, the owl statue. Holy fuck. Dude, I'm actually, I'm actually here. Wait a minute, this wait a minute, wait a minute. If they have these meetings every single year at Bohemian Grove, why it looks like nobody's been there in a long time? Insane. Get up close no on it. Way. Bohemian Bro, get up close on it. I made it. It's supposed to be Bohemian Grove, where people what go and worship fuck? the owl statue. Yeah, get up on no there. way. Get up on there. This is fucking cool. Where's the big owl statue? Oh, that's hollow. No, I'm talking about the big one. Yeah. They need to fill this pond up. They do. Yeah, that's the owl. Bunch of ferns have grown nah, on. Nah, that don't that don't look like that don't look. Like. I'm gonna knock it down. We're gonna I go from the bottom up. There we go. Oh, you, you know they got a contest like this where you eat the apart. whole entire oh, yeah. burger. Today I'm at free. Varsity Bar in Italy, where I'm about. Bro, this is literally just seasoned beef patty with a whole bunch of cheese on there. But yo, if she's able to accomplish this task. I will forever respect her in a Guinness Book of World Records after she comes back from the hospital. Out to take on the brand new Randy Santel Burger Stack Challenge. I'm feeling Ooh, confident, yeah. and I'm I need glad. to feel confident because once healthy, again, I need more good. patties than I've ever tackled before. In front of me, Ooh, I have a 20 so stack burger, mm. which has 20 of their roughly I three to four ounce man. burger patties layered with American cheese. I also Ooh. have to uh, finish one kilo of their wings. I went with barbecue, the wings, and then I also have some of their loaded fries, which are covered in their cheese whip, which is crazy, a little bit of bacon, and then, of course, some greens just for health. I also have to finish <laughs> this Pyrex measuring cup full of strawberry Damn, milkshake, which is, that I guess, is diabetes. That's Let's get some of these uh, patties. Oh, let me see. Let me see how much Ooh, I tell you what, I'm feeling some type of way already. Ooh, I gotta get these 18 down. Then I'm gonna really beat the record by two. Alright, so if y'all wanna see if you actually complete that, go to this TikToker. You can watch. Oh, wait, it's not showing that whole TikToker's name. Yeah, and then. Oh, wait, that's actually her. Yeah, that's actually her. Yeah, go to her TikTok and see if she finishes. Whoa, whoa, hold up, hold up. Let me read the text real quick before I, I comment on this, what seems like stupid shit. There's no man on earth that can stomach this mouth. Says, thank God, not all women are like this. She should run and not look, should, should she run and not look back? Wait, wait, hold up, hold up. Hold up, hold up. Is this per month? No, let's see if it's per month.
Is this? Once the DNA test proves that. Okay, so I'm I'm guessing. Okay, first of all, toys. No. Two thousand dollars for diapers. I didn't know di. Hmm. Huh? They expensive. That don't make no sense. That's price gouging at that point. <laughs> if they that expensive, that's that's straight up price gouging. Okay, and then you got clo the clothes. I can the, the clothes. I can. So we're gonna be your wife. Why the clothes? The diapers cost way more but than first, the clothes. We might as well hear Adam's side of the story. Here's that la very last minute, Maury. I didn't find out I was seven months. Go, well, go watch that TikToker. Okay, so we're going to end this uh, part four here and about to film a part five next. But ain't no way. Like, I hope they talking about per year and not per month. 3000 Yeah, that don't seem right per year. Right. I can see if it's like you spending like $200 a month on diapers, you know, especially if you got like a, a sick baby or something like that. That's understandable. But $3,000? That seemed like... Mama wants some new shoes type of money. All right. So y'all go ahead and be safe while I smack you on the face. I'm about to go ahead and report part five. Peace.